So what if you're scared to buy a home because of interest rates and inventory? Inventory is still super rare. In Malvern, we only have 52 homes, which is one twelfth of what we need for the year. And actually over two thirds of them, closer to 70% are over $1.3 million. So if you're looking for anything up to a million, it's still very, very tight. But Kirk, interest rates are up. Yes, so I've been getting this question. What do we do next? So I figured out the four outcomes. The first outcome is if you buy a house, your interest rate will go up. Um, interest rates will go down is the second one. Prices of homes will go up or prices of homes will go down. So here's the, here's the crux of it, right? Here's the mindset you should be in right now if you're buying a home. Number one, if interest rates go up, you'll be happy. Number two, if interest rates go down, you'll refinance. Number three, if prices go up, you'll be happy. Number four, if prices go down, the worst we ever saw was an 08 and that was 20%. And you go, wow, that's a lot. But here's the deal. The only people that lost 20% were the people that sold your, their home. If you have a five-year time horizon, you're usually okay, right? Five-year time horizon. So in my experience of almost 20 years in investing, helping people buy and sell real estate, if you don't have five years, you probably shouldn't buy a house. So think of it that way. So four out of four, if you need a house, you need a house. But we're here to support you. If it's a short journey, a long journey, tomorrow, next month, next year, whatever your plan is, but I'd love to talk to you about it personally. Talk to you soon. Reach me at 484-880-2388, info at kirksimmon.com, or just send me a message on this platform. Take care.